Okay, questions? How was your uh, quick trip to Tennessee? Uh, it was tough um, as far as um, Coach Sparks, Ken Sparks, been the head coach at Carson Newman for I think 31, 32 years. Great man, great Christian man, and he's um, probably not going to make it another day or two. Um, he's in hospice. Um, but the great thing about it is he brought everybody together. He's been doing that clinic for over 30 years. Um, it's a husband-wife clinic and uh, to strengthen marriages and, and minister to coaches and wives. And, uh, and we had a lot of co great coaches there. Um, Clyde Christensen, the offensive coordinator at the um, Dolphins that came. And um, we had uh, um, Chan Gailey was there. And, uh, you know, just a lot of really neat, neat people. Fisher DeBerry was there. So it was a... a, a it was uplifting, a celebration of his life, but it was also good seeing friends, but it was also a tough situation. So thanks for asking. Coming back here, anything specific you want to get accomplished this, this last week? Yes, uh, we're just keep trying to improve and keep going. Um, and, uh, you know, we're still keep looking at guys, trying to get, get them in harder and harder positions um, as far as, the, the, not the position they're at, but say you're playing linebacker, trying to find ways to put more stress on him in certain situations in practice that they haven't seen before. Um, trying to make it more and more game-like. Um, today we had, um, I had an impromptu type of, uh, this was one of those 50-50 days, so I could uh, I could tackle some of it. So we did a little bit of tackling today, which was good. Came out and unscathed and kind of an impromptu. We want to see how they handled it. And didn't tell anybody, and here we went. See how the coach, we got some good enthusiasm. So I thought, it, thought we uh, had a good day in that aspect of it. And our kickers are kicking uh, a lot better. The last uh, three times we put them in live situations, uh, They've kicked really, really well, so that's encouraging to see on our field goal kickers. A year ago, you had a lot of juniors and seniors up at last, and uh -huh. kind of your leaders out on the field. Are you seeing some of the younger guys starting to step up into that? Role? Yeah, I am, but we still have a lot of juniors yeah. and seniors on this team. Um, but I am seeing that some of the younger guys are having to step into roles and having to push through it and play, uh, and doing a good job. You know. Our, uh, our, all our quarterbacks are relatively young, and I see them taking charge of the huddle and handling different things. And you know, we don't huddle much, but formations, alignments, getting them lined up, getting them moving fast, um, handling all that, uh, I think has been, been good. Put them in some um, tough situations today, last plays of the game, different things like that. I thought they handled that well. Um, and then, you know, defensively, um, I think that uh, you know, uh, Rick Gamboa is the guy stepping up, and Poe's the guy stepping up, and. Um, so it, it's, it's good to, to see all those guys. And when we get Derek back out there full time, he'll be a steady leader in that group. Leo Jackson's been a leader in that group. So i uh, pleased with those guys. Those guys that are out, like Derek and, and Jamal, uh -huh. yeah. how have they progressed as far as uh, their rehab? They're, they're, well, everything I've been told, they're doing really, really well. And they're moving around and they're doing all the drill. They've been there every day. There hasn't been a day that they haven't missed where they've had a setback. Um, so it looks like they're right on track to be back just like they should be, being able to do stuff this summer and, you know, have a good two, two and a half months to be really full go before we hit. So, and of course, during fall practice, since we don't have two a days now, the way we're spreading it out, um, I think it helped them be able to not miss as many as you would when you have two a days because you wouldn't go twice a day with those coming off the knees. So hopefully that'll help them have four or five more practices they'd be able to have under their belt they wouldn't have had with the two a day situation. All right, thanks. Thanks, Coach. All right.